Hello ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome back to another stream, we are live and today we are again at Athens, today we will try to complete this flight and we are flying today from Athens to Istanbul, Turkey, we are just waiting for our co-pilot to get back in, he has been doing some stuffs out there, I don't know what he's doing, he will take care of all this and all this as well, we will keep our Lighting systems off today, wait for him to get this thing done. Shout our clock. Our boarding has been done, but still we will ask for board. No issues on the walk around. There we go. The right side door is still open for catering. Roger. There we go. So we will just put in our weights and everything. He will ask for a few more things in here. We will just complete this one. Let's see our weights today. 54.6. 54.6. By. 31.4. Drop your layer 6.3 today. Anyways, uh, let's get the uh, NFC for us today. So we one plus F03 right. 10 11 should be there. Then cheers, so I think we're ready for all the things down here. Yeah, looks like good. So it's one down zero point three. One down zero point three. That's what it's in here. Reflex is sixty eight degrees twelve eighty, I believe yeah, twelve eighty. 68 degrees 1280 1280 by 1280 you can see yeah 1280 by 1280 and trans altitude is 9000 yeah speeds it has given us some speeds but we will take Some of the speeds, 142, 142, and 145, 144 in fact. Okay, so I think we are good with this, 68. 
cruise altitude is Hi, the security and safety check are all done. Are we good to start boarding? Yes, please. Okay. D nine thousand. So let's run in the Are brief. You ready for the departure brief. Go ahead. Okay, the newest weather shows good conditions. We'll plan to push and start for a two engine taxi. There are no hot spots along our taxi route. It will be a left seat takeoff. And we'll be using radar. We'll plan on a normal thrust takeoff. Prior to V1, for any master warning, engine fire or failure that will prevent the aircraft from flying safely, we'll abort and stop on the runway. After V1, we'll take it flying and deal with it in the air and plan to come back here. Any questions? No questions. Okay, that completes the brief. So briefs have been done. So cockpit preparation checklist. Gear pins and covers. Remote. Fuel quantity. Six three two zero kilograms. Seat belts. On. Adiers. Nav. Barrel ref. One zero one one set. One zero one one set. Cockpit preparation checklist completed. So that door will be closing soon. There you go, forward cargo door is now closed, teaching and everything is done. Yes. Before start checklist. Before start checklist. Parking brake. Set. Takeoff speeds and thrust. Toga. 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 V1142. VR142. V2144. Flex temp 6, 8 degrees. Windows. Closed. Beacon. On. Before start checklist completed. So, our before start checklist has been done. Let's see how much pushback will be there. I reckon it's... going to be 100. Cockpit to ground. Go ahead, flight tech. We will be ready shortly. Roger.
Because we are ready for the pushback. That tug is connected down there, I believe. It's coming in. There you go. It is now connected. So I think we are good for pushback, so... Cockpit to ground. Go ahead, flight tech. We are ready for pushback and engine start. Roger. Release the parking brakes, please. Parking brakes released. Pushing back. You are clear behind, and you can start your engines at your discretion. Starting engine one. Okay. So we're pushing back and starting our first engine, guys. So engine one has started. There we go, engine one is now spawning up. Pushback complete, set parking brakes please. Parking brakes set. Roger. Okay, the tow bar is disconnected and the equipment is clear. We will see you on the left side with the pin. Thanks, and you can disconnect and go to hand signals. Thanks. Have a good flight. See you later. Starting engine two. Okay. So now we are starting engine two. waiting for the engine to be fully up. Red Katari is taking off. There you go. Nice engine back to normal. So it will do all these things. To start checklist anti ice off ecam status checked pitch trim set and checked set and checked rudder trim neutral 
after start checklist completed. Okay, so I think we are good for our check seat. So let's see. Clear left side. Clear right side. Brake check. Pressure zero. Light control check. Ready. Full up. Full down. Neutral. Full left. Full right. Neutral. Rudder. Full left. Full right. Neutral. Taxi checklist. Flight controls. Checked. Checked. Flap setting. Config 1 plus F. Config 1 plus F. Radar and predictive wind shear system. On and auto. On and auto. Engine mode selector. Normal. Decam memo. Take off, no blue. Taxi checklist completed. Welcome on board our flight today. This is the lead flight attendant speaking. Please direct your attention to the cabin Let's go, guys. for important safety information. There is an instruction card in your seat pocket that illustrates the... Hello, David. Hello, OG. Finally got the solution for the crash. That was less space in the game folder and this. I thought some bad livery or add-on that you added, but that might be the reason also. But if you are facing such issues in future, always clear your folder. But glad to hear, brother, you found the solution. For a second. Oxygen will be flowing to the mask even though the bag may not inflate. Cover your nose and mouth with the mask. Place the okay. elastic Let's bag around your head by pulling on the ends. Secure your own mask before assisting others. Your seat bottom cushion may be used as a flotation device. Pull up and remove the cushion. Upon exiting aircraft. Place your arms around the cushion and hold on to the strap located on the back. This is a non-smoking flight. Smoking is not permitted in the cabin or laboratory. Cabin lights will now be turned off. Reading light buttons are located above your seat. Thank you for your attention. Thank you. Clear for departure. Take off runway confirmed. Approach path clear of traffic. Cabin crew be seated for takeoff. Again, there is an AGN on my left hand side. Are you on any ATC network or offline for this flight? I am offline for this flight. There is ground air, but uh, there is no ground in uh, Istanbul, so I prefer to go offline. They should have been on both sides, then I should have gone. I will hold short here and let that AGN go in front of me. There is one more, in fact, two more planes behind me. I 
Hello, Sitch. There is Italian and then another Asian. I will let this Asian line up and then I will take off behind him. From Taxiway Delta 1. This is Delta 1. There you go, Delta 1 D. मेरा बात टाइम पे घर कॉलेज से अरे मेरा पावर कट का भी आया मतलब मैंने स्ट्रीम बहुत पहले कर देनी थी किस्मत हो रहा है तू एनीवे सो गाइस दिस होल्ड शॉट हियर एंड लेट दैट एजन टेक ऑफ They went for that runway. <laughs> okay, that agent took off. Let's see if there is anyone coming from this side. Doesn't look like so. So, I think we are good for lineup. Last check, everything looks good. Yeah. Lineup checklist. Take off runway. Confirmed. Runway three right. Confirmed. T cast. T A R A. Packs one and two. Off. Lineup checklist completed. Hello, Aripaji. Take off. There is a small twin otter coming back there. It's a twin otter? No, no, it's not a twin otter. So, guys, we have line up. So we're ready for takeoff. So, we're on our son. On both sides. And that Lutfanza has to wait. No plane incoming. And I think we are good for takeoff. Distance maintained over at Amaro's plane car. How many waters do you have on your setup? Only one. I had a second one of my laptop to read comments, but that has now been too old. So, only one main monitor, and there are a couple of mobiles. One is for the webcam, one is for reading comments down here. 40% engine and stabilizing, full racing brakes. Pushing down on the York. Let's go. SRS Manflex Toga take off no no green auto thrust blue man toga SRS auto thrust V1 rotate positive climb gear up Gear up. Autopilot one on.
So a good climb out of the beautiful Athens airport, guys. You can see it. Packs are on. Flaps zero. Speed checked. Flaps zero. So good positive climb out of here guys. ये वाला वीडियो देखा था मेरा कौन सा वाला ले वाला पता नहीं देखा होगा शायद याद नहीं आ रहा अभी चेक करना पड़ेगा फिर से देखना पड़ेगा फिर से अभी भाजी So we're going to climb, so we'll turn off our APUs now. The lights 10,000 pro could be Crossing 6,000 for 9,000 now because 9,000 is our earlier climb. 9,000 can decide over whether we go somewhere or not. Currently, just reaching 9,000. Beautiful guys. Lave. Lay Mumbai kar nickel wala 10 second ka video tha nahi paji. Mujhe DM kar do uska link. Main dekhta hu kaun sa. Yaad nahi aa raha. Agar main dekha bhi ho. Okay, we are 9,000, so we will cross 9,000 now. We have to go 37,000 today. Set standard. Standard cross checked. Passing flight level zero nine one. Now. We have set standard now. After 10,000, we will clear our red naps. Clear red nav. Clear red nav. Okay. Seat belts off. So we had a beautiful climb out of here, guys. We are going to be going all the way over the Aegean Sea, crossing into Turkey. We will be flying all the way to the coasts. Are you using any Payway Airport Sentry for Athens or Istanbul? Yes, for both the airports I am using the Payway Sentry. There was a Payway back there as well on Istanbul and there will be Payway in Istanbul. There will be Payway on the other airport as well. Athens was Payway Sentry. Even Istanbul, I have for the airport as well as for the city. Both of them. That's why Istanbul was looking like that. 
you have control. I have control. So we have given the control to the plane and we can chill enjoy with some music guys. Let's see, okay. While we are having some tea. We are now climbing out of Istanbul, sorry, out of Athens. There's a plane right, right above me, somewhere or below me, I don't know. It is, it is somewhere, but we are taking left now. See the upper column, see the signs are all. All the lights are off. Everything looks good. Upper column looks good. Uh, so yeah, which scenery are you using for both Athens and Istanbul? Wait, let me check the folder. Community. There we go. Community. Community. For Athens, I'm using uh, Fly Tempa. Fly Tempa is the designer. For Athens City also I had like uh, PSoft I think I haven't put it in this time but it was something from P I remember Wait, let me check I didn't use the Athens City this time but I'm sure it was something from Pris uh, Pearlsoft Pearlsoft yeah Pearlsoft Athens landmark I didn't use them this time okay then for Istanbul I am using Wait, which one is Istanbul is for Istanbul airport I'm using uh Sinri TR airport okay Paji Chakarto Sinri TR airport and for the city of Istanbul I am using where is that where is that for the city of Istanbul I am using AC scenery city space that is the name of the developer. If you want to tell me some of the scenarios where you fly, just message me. I will pass it on to you. No worries. Just message me on Discord that I am going to be flying today to this airport. Can I have this scenery? I will pass it on to you and then put it in the community folder. It will work. But always check if that scenery is available by default in Microsoft Flight Simulator. Because if it is available, it will not work. Because you can't have two liveries for the same airport. Wait, Aribaji, let me check your... That one. I think on my right hand side will be the small islands. Front, that is the land of... This, this is the Asian Sea guys that we are crossing right now. The beautiful Asian Sea. There are a couple of small islands out here. That one small island down there. This was then the bigger one part. That is from where we will enter. Okay. Checking the video from RBI.
मुंबई का निकल लो कि आपने पर इसकी वीडियो अपने चैनल में क्यों डाली थी मुंबई बेवर सेंट्री फॉर मुंबई पटना एंड बेंगलोर ओके नाइस No, no. Join the Discord later. I will tell you something that will be useful. Hello, guys. Hello. Hello. What is happening, guys? Hello. 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 ये ऑलरेडी लाइक हाफ वे हो गया मेरा ये हाफ वे नहीं हुआ अभी क्रूज पहुंच रहा हूँ स्ट्रीम कर रहे हो यार यस एस ऑलवेज ये कसीन अच्छा लगा माइक्रोसॉफ्ट के बंदों के लिए डाला था हाँ पर ठीक है अच्छा बढ़िया There is always cozy. मैंने करेक्शन तो दे दी आपने सुना नहीं अराइवल रन में क्या है और लेफ्ट कहाँ जा रहे हो आप लोग और राइट पास लोग क्लोज रन में हैं वो वे नॉट लैंडिंग देर वे लाइक वे टेक लेफ्ट लेफ्ट पोस्टर जा कर रहे हो तुम लोग हम शर्म अल शेख जा रहे हैं ये भाई साहब ओ मैंने देखा नहीं ईशान है ईशान भाई ना मेरे को लगा कोई और है मैंने एक्चुअली वो वाले और ले नहीं लगाया ना डिस्कॉर्ड वाला पर जो भी करता वो नहीं देखता आओ भाई मैंने कहा आवाज तो जानी पहचानी लग रही है और ईशान भाई क्या हाल चाल है कहाँ गायब रहते हो भाई बीजू में कहीं गायब भी हो जाते हो भाई साहब मतलब हमें कब चक्कर लगवा रहे हो फिर कॉपीट में बैठ के लगाएंगे ऐसे नहीं मानेंगे तो आपने बंदों का फायदा क्या और नौकरी जाए पर नहीं हम तो भाई बैठेंगे जो लोकलिटी का पासिंग सिक्स थाउजेंड फीट आज सब मौजूद है राहुल का है <laughs> बहुत बिजी रहता है आजकल बंदा माँ बाप ने कहा चल ज्यादा उड़ रहा भाग यहाँ से हाजी मेरी भी सुबह से काटी थी अभी आई है तब जाके ये उड़ान शुरू की है मैं फिर इन्वर्टर पे कर देता हूँ लैंडिंग बस यही एक अच्छी चीज रहती है हेलीकॉप्टर हेलीकॉप्टर पता नहीं भाजी आपके साथ ही क्यों हो रहा है ईशान बता सकते हैं इनका करप्ट क्यों हो रहा है बार बार यही मतलब ये इंस्टॉल कर रहे हैं ना पावर कट की वजह से हो रहा है क्या बार बार इनका बस क्योंकि मेरा बीच में रुकता भी है तो मेरा करप्ट नहीं होता है मगर इनका पता है सबसे बड़ा चक्कर क्या है यूपीए यूपीएस वगैरह नहीं है इनका सीधे शटडाउन हो जाता है बंद पूरा मुझे लग रहा है उसी की वजह से हो रहा है हाँ हाँ 
वेरीफाई रहता है वहाँ पे तो वेरीफिकेशन का भी ऑप्शन नहीं है ना आपका एक्सबॉक्स के अंदर तो फल ओ भाई थर्टी फाइव राइट और थर्टी फाइव लेफ्ट कितने पास पास है भाई यार अच्छ कैसे होगा वन वन एट पॉइंट जीरो सेवन नहीं केकड़ा नहीं मिलेगा इस्तानबुल में इतनी हवा नहीं चल रही है वो तो परसों जहाँ उतरा था वहाँ हवा थी भाई गस्ट आ रही थी ट्वेंटी सिक्स विंड तो छोड़ ही दो गस्ट ट्वेंटी सिक्स थी भाई क्या कर सकता है बंदा नहीं पाजी 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 आपने ज, मैंने जल्दी बोल दिया देखने को मिल सकता है यार ट्वेंटी वन विंड चल रही है अभी इस्तानबुल में डिपेंड <laughs> करता है कैसे उतरेगी हेलो टू फू चलो ये तो हो गया क्रूज 400 है कॉस्ट इंडेक्स 80 है जब मेरे पे गेम यूज करो थी ना तो ओंकार भाई देखते थे वो सिंगापुर के पर उतरे रहे ओंकार भाई बता दो यार कस्टम स्क्रिप्ट कैसे डालते हैं क्या कैसे डालते अच्छा वेट एक सेकंड समझ नहीं आया मुझे जी मैंने पढ़ाई पे बहुत मेहनत की है वैसे भी एम एस सी ऐसे नहीं की माइक्रोबायोलॉजी में अरे आपने माइक्रोबायोलॉजी में मेरी मम्मी बैंड बच जाती है भाई पढ़ दे एक चीज नहीं है ना माइक्रोब्स के नाम दवाइयों के नाम सबके नाम एक ही में घुसाए हुए हैं जी ग्रेजुएशन में तो हमारे पास भी केमिस्ट्री थी ऑर्गेनिक इन गोर्गेनिक फिजिकल तीनों थी नहीं नहीं वो नहीं बोलता था मैथ मेरे को बचपन से टफ लगता था ठीक है ये मैथ हमारे में नहीं था साइंस वाले नो मैथ्स मैं ये लोग क्या पीसीएम का बस फिर जय माता दी थी बायोलॉजी में उसको समझ आता नहीं तो मतलब मैं मैथ ही ले ले जब कम से कम पासिंग मार्क्स आ ही जाते थे कितना भी खराब हो लेकिन जब केमिस्ट्री और फिजिक्स में मैथ होता ना उसके बाद मेरा दिमाग खराब हो गया मैं बोला यार यहां भी मैं एफ एम एफ एम चल रहा है कि आप ने प्ले नहीं धीरे चल रहा है हंसते हंसते कर रहा हूँ आई एम और ये एमरन पे फोर थाउजेंड होना चाहिए ये ऊपर क्यों है टू ट्वेंटी एट फोर थाउजेंड ठीक है उसके बाद डिसल उसके बाद गटपी गटपी इज डन यर गटपी नहीं ले रहे हैं गटपी के बाद नफ्स टू नफ्स टू एयरपोर्ट एलिवेशन इज थ्री ट्वेंटी फाइव थ्री सिक्सटी थ्री ट्वेंटी फाइव थ्री सिक्सटी रे वन वे थ्री टेन है नैब में आया वन जीरो नाइन पॉइंट फाइव फाइव वन जीरो नाइन पॉइंट फाइव फाइव कोर्सेज थ्री 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 एटी फोर ठीक है इन द इनफो है गाइस इनफो इज For that U H M U H M 
radial is three fifty three. Radius is eighty. U H M three fifty three and radius is ten nautical miles. वाह भाई साहब मैं अभी अभी क्रूज पे पहुंचा और मेरे डिसेंट पॉइंट भी दिख गया है बहुत बढ़िया ट्वेंटी वन है वेंड यार ये तंग करेगी भाजी जो देता है ना सिम ब्रीफ उतना करना पड़ता है आपको अपने तक नहीं होता है ये वन जीरो वन सिक्स वन जीरो वन सिक्स विन्स जीरो फाइव जीरो बाई ट्वेंटी वन ट्वेंटी टू लिख रहा था एंड टेम्परेचर इज ट्वेंटी फोर डिग्री सेल्सियस मिनिमम आर डिसीजन ऑल्टीट्यूड इज फाइव हंड्रेड एंड आपका पी सी है ना हाँ And miss approaches, Kagi miss approach, miss approach climb three thousand head to the air, it hit set sold so three thousand is the miss approach. Ah, I think we would we will descend to four thousand. Trans altitude for Turkey is twelve thousand. Hmm, there's a plane behind me. Boy, sir, सामने वेदर बहुत ही गंदा लग रहा है हमें तो. अच्छा Our current weather shows nice BFR conditions, and we've got the arrival and approach for guidance in FMS for descent planning to get down to the airport. It'll be an ILS approach. The runway is dry, and we take the first available turn in taxi to the gate for ATC instructions. Once cleared, we can plan to start the APU for taxi in. Primary threat will be weather. Any questions? No questions. Brief complete. माफ करो भाई 
देखा है आपने वो उसके स्ट्रीम पे अच्छा उसने वो ये भी बोला था हाँ ये देखो ना देली करो यार दे मुझे दे कहाँ है अच्छा ये ये बात चल रहा है बनाया है उसका मत करो यार केजर तापड़िया मत करो मत करो यार ओ भाई साहब भाई बड़े गंदे हो तुम भाई किसी को नहीं पकड़ते हो Okay. I have control. You have control. Minus one thousand पे भी एक plane fly कर रहा है हमसे guys. Where are you guys flying to? Everyone is flying in a different direction. अच्छा, I'm doing uh, Mumbai to Sydney right. Oh my God, such a long flight. Ah. All the best. <laughs> And fun fact is that my sim hasn't crashed yet. Which is of course a very good thing, Sai. <laughs> Absolutely, I'm getting solid Are forty points. <laughs> नहीं साइक की साइड लाइट नहीं जाती है साइक ये होता है और लीस अरे स्वीट को फ्रॉम एथेंस अगेन यू होम टाउन एंड देयर इज अ प्लेन इन फ्रंट ऑफ मी समवेयर आई कैन सी इट राइट हियर विल यू बी एबल टू डिसेंड बिकॉज़ इट इज 1000 स्टार्ट बाय गाइस ओके नेवर माइंड इट्स गोना क्रॉस अस देयर वी गो इट्स जस्ट क्रॉस दिस सो लीस We are in Asian again. The beautiful looking Asian aircraft. Hello, 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 hello. Yes, yes, yes. There you go. Five thousand above me now. And there he is. Just crossed us. And we are landing at Istanbul. It's a bit of a tricky landing, but the winds are not favorable. Asian guy, Greece. Yes, Greece. Asian A320. हमने पता है ये राहुल चावल हमने कितना Asian use किया है जब हम Corfu वगैरह उतरते थे. भाई साथ में बहुत भाई उसमें लास्ट मोमेंट में करेक्शन है ना वहाँ ब्रिज के पास में बिल्कुल थोड़ा सा राइट में टेन डी वी डेविएशन है वहाँ एयरपोर्ट पे कॉर्फू उसके बाद मॉन्टी नेगरो में टिवाट पे उसमें भी टेन डिग्री डेविएशन है पर टिवाट पे विंड्स बहुत गंदी रहती है बता ना एकदम से आती है माउंटेन से हमेशा रेडी अरे उसकी ना एक नई सेंट्री आई थी वो रिलीज नहीं की यार उन्होंने यार अभी पेड़ में ही रखी हुई है वो मिल जाए ना वो निकली थी अगस्त सितंबर के अराउंड मगर वो अभी तक पुरानी वाली साइट पे है ये नई वाली लाइन वो बड़ी तगड़ी है मैंने देखा था ना कौन सी प्लेन्स वो एनिमेटेड वाली हाँ नहीं देखना पड़ेगा मैंने फिर इतनी गोर से नहीं देखी है मुझे फिर से एक बार देखना पड़ेगा कौन सा फ्लैट प्लान Nice. <laughs> 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 
पूरा हिल जाता है वो खड़खड़ खड़खड़ होने लगता है भाई जैसे ही वो चालीस से पचास जाता है वो टेक ऑफ कर लेता है थोड़ा थोड़ा चलो हमारा वाला पचास से रोटे, रोटेट करना शुरू करता है ये पचास से हमारा वाला स्पीड लेना शुरू करता है इसकी टैक्सी थर्टी है उसकी ऑलमोस्ट टेक ऑफ थर्टी है हाँ भाई So guys, we are almost now descending. Yeah, but it's like somewhere that side. मेरा वाला मत बना ना बस इसमें ये change कर देना yoke and throttle. वो लेना T C A वाला या अन्य कोम ले लेना पैसे डाल के बस. सही. किसी को याद है वो एक प्लेन इंट्रोड्यूस किया था इनने एक्सट्रीम करके जो बड़ा तेज उड़ता था किसका था वो मुझे याद नहीं आ रहा नहीं वो सिंगल इंजन था उसका जो सिंपल वर्जन था वो ज्यादा तेज नहीं उड़ता था दो सौ ढाई सौ उड़ता था पर उसका एक एक्सट्रीम निकाला था वो ग्यारह सौ बारह सौ चले जाता था पर पूरा हिलने लगता था एक्सट्रीम करके कुछ था फ्लाइट सिम डॉट टीओ पे था वो अवेलेबल पता नहीं हटाया नहीं हटाया पर चक्कर जरा है कि वो
Bro, you like hold a new age in Livimo. I haven't flown the old one. I have seen it once or twice. It looks pretty good. But I have only flown the new one. Never flown the old one. How is it? You tell me. Air India ki pata nahi aaye nahi aaye. Okay, let's close the discord for now and land properly play some music till we get closer phoenix a320 should have old ones because in real life only winglets and ears have new liveries i think there are a few such as the british airlines it has a few old liveries in the livery manager here let me check Opening me. Look, the air language has the old one, the retro one. Okay, yeah, I can see one retro. Another one is Aerosoft. It has the retro one. Two, Air Berlin has the classic retro one. Okay. Air Canada has the classic one, 1980s. Uh, okay, then Air France has the retro one, and then Air Malta has the retro one. New modern classic. Quite a few number of planes have the retro ones. Wait. Who else do we find here as the retro one classic from Asset Austria have that one okay Australia have the Austrian Airways have the retro ones Kaha chale ke? Arre, utarne wala hona tabhi band kar diya abhi fila Old one is white livery New is blue. Okay, that should be the white one. Okay. I haven't seen the old one. I think still. And then who else has retro in here? Classic Avianca is there. Classic Avianca. See, British has quite a few old ones here. Yeah. It has the British standard Casolidian and everything. Air Cuba Condor has the retro one. In fact, two retro ones. That is beautiful. There are quite a few number of planes that have retro ones in here. Air Gulf has some retro ones. Uh, 
Okay, let's change to standard 1.16. QNH 1016 set. QNH 1016 set. Set passing 10100. Now approach checklist. Barrel ref 1016. One zero one six set. One zero one six set. Seat belts on minimum. Five one zero feet set. Auto brake. Set and checked. Engine mode selector. Normal. Approach checklist completed. So quite a few have that at least. I want to fly to one of the the airports in Cuba. It has a beautiful approach, but I am not able to find that airport. I saw the video many a times. The runway is like in the middle of middle of the forest you can see the approach is pretty beautiful from the seaside and then as soon as you go there it's, it's you land from the side where the runway is close and there is no barriers on the runway you can see and i'm pretty sure it's on cuba side somewhere but i'm not able to find that airport i so want to land in that airport i've seen some videos but now i'm not able to find the videos anymore that is a beautiful looking airport It looks still our approach is kind of a strange here you will see that we go from here from here we could have gone straight here but due to our heights and everything we are still taking that left hand turn hmm. i like your indian uh, Air India in A310 old livery. That was a classic. I still remember that when I was a kid. Uh, I think I was seven years old, or six year old when I took my first year flight in Air India. It used to be a government plane then. There were only like two aircrafts at that time. One of them was Air India, the another one was Jet Air. There used to be no private players at that time. Jet Air was a private. No, it was a semi-government actually. Only two aircrafts used to operate in my side of the world from Kashmir to Jammu and other stations. One was Air India, another was Jet Airways. No, Vistara, Vistara came pretty late in like 2000 something. Uh, Kingfisher, it wasn't there. Indigo, it wasn't there. Like there was none of them. Apodo, I will write a little bit of story. Okay, okay, okay. So there were like none of these. There is an aircraft coming from this side. Miss losing altitude. It will be right in front of me somewhere here. Oh, 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 oh. This is sounding like trouble. Then tell me this is sounding like trouble. Look at this aircraft. Only 900 feet above me. So we're here. 700. It's it's crossing over here. 600. Five hundred, it's gone white that it's in my path, but it hasn't still gone. When I was a kid, there were Olympic year and um, Greece Asian came after. I, I have heard a lot about the Olympic year. Okay, 
It's good that this aircraft will class over. It's somewhere down here. Not able to spot it still, but it's somewhere here. Minus 1000. On my right hand side. I've heard the bar about Olympian a lot. An aircraft just passed us somewhere here. Let's see if we can see this aircraft in night time. Night time will be pretty easy to spot. You see? Look at this. Night time it's pretty easy to spot. That one was here. But in daytime yeah, it's pretty hard to spot these aircrafts. It was here and the second one was here. You can't even see the beacon now properly. It's right down here somewhere. Anyways, yeah, so we are holding at 9000 for now. We have plenty of fuel, so nothing to worry about. No aircraft on our left hand side. We're keeping this speed till here and, and let's Let's make it 160. Actually, just let's clear it. Let it guide on its own. Olympian Air, I have seen a lot of 7 in that uh, Boeing 73. I don't know if. No, no, I have seen Olympian in A320 as well. Seen them in 737 Olympian Air. I know that that was the aircraft of that side, yeah. yeah. Speed brakes are now armed. Still gonna check about the winds down there at the airport. They didn't look nice before. We still have a 20 nautical mile wind. 0, 050 0 by 20. So wind is still pretty high down here. You can see crosswinds of 9, 10, 9, 10 here. But on the airport they will be pretty high. Airport is right right down there. Just trying to keep my composure with that. Right here is the airport somewhere down there. It's a beautiful looking airport by the way guys. It doesn't fly anymore. Ah, that's sad. It was 737 classic from that. It's 700 Athens airport. That's the sad one. I'm pretty sure it has a livery down here in the PMDG operation center. Because I have seen Olympia a lot of time here. If you want, we can fly it. Yeah, Olympian Air. Yeah. See? A blue strip and everything. 2022 livery. 2022 livery. I don't know how is the livery so updated. I got a livery of 2020. But still good to see old classic planes. <laughs> like the clouds on the airport, guys. Yeah, the speed will decrease as well. Here, but it's like right here somewhere. Can we spot the airport? 
it says that the airport is like right here somewhere uh, I don't know like here somewhere I'm still able to spot the airport might be this one but might be somewhere here upper column never mind the airport is somewhere here on the upper column maybe behind these clouds or somewhere we're just flying at 4000 right now it's uh, frictional on Olymp olympian air doesn't exist anymore yeah because PMDG developers from Greece, so they made frictional livery, yeah, in the love of that livery. That is the thing, they made it in the love of that plane. But that's good, man. That's good that they're proud of that plane. At least something for the people to do. You can fly, you can enjoy that plane. You love flying over liveries and all, no? Lap one. Check speed. I wanted to go for lap one, but it's not allowing me. It's saying check your speed. The aircraft's landing in front of me down here. They will be taking the same pattern. Okay, this one is behind me. The second one is in front of me, minus 18. So it's going for the 3000 barrier. Istanbul city down there we will be able to have a glimpse of that before going into land airport is like somewhere up here we knew that we've seen that airport a couple of times let's see how it goes there are a few aircrafts one is behind us it's also descending one is right in front of us on this path but wind has picked up you can see the wind it's really really hard now and we will get a crosswind so again a crab landing all the rest <laughs> can only get crab landings so crab landing crab landing you can see the winds down there in the oceans Now maybe it will let me deploy my flaps. Flap one. Speed checked. Flaps one. So now it allowed me to deploy my flaps now. You can see first set of flaps coming out. Thank God for that. So that is the city of Istanbul right in front of me. But we will be taking a left turn here for the airport. Which is like somewhere up here. Still not visible. Maybe down somewhere here. Ah, it will look good. Twenty six nautical mile headwind. If I had to line like this, it was okay because it was a headwind. But when I go this side, it will be a crosswind, which is not so easy to line at. Look at that. Holding patterns. Three thousand. Three thousand. Three thousand. Three thousand. Oh, 
Red is the diesel point. Oh man, this is getting cloudy as well now. There is an air cut behind me, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, he is directly behind me. He is hi. He's directly behind me. He's high now. He is above me somewhere. And due to clouds, I'm not able to see him, but I'm pretty sure he is somewhere high. Above me. Bing map, yes. Today we are using Bing maps, but with some sentries for this city. Custom sentry for Istanbul. That is why this building is coming up and everything else. And this must be a mosque. And that city as well. Yeah, but still not visible, but it's a little bit you can see. Let's turn on the localizer. Look, still that plane here is like right next to me here. He is there, right there. You can see him now. Coming into view. It's, he's right behind me here. He's right here. I saw him for a second or two. We caught the localizer. That is the plane, guys, right behind us. As we're passing over the city of Istanbul. I don't know what is that plane trying to do. He's trying to cut before me. You can see he is right on my wing somewhere. There he is. Maybe he's landing on left and I'm landing on right. So we might be even closer than you think. There he is. For me, localizer is caught, but what a crosswind, guys. Look at the crosswind. Oh my god, such a crosswind. The plane is also there, right there. He is a bit fast on approach, I'm a bit slow. Flaps 2. Speed checked. Flaps 2. Gear down. Gear down. Cabin crew be seated for landing. I can't see that plane. He is landing on left or he's landing on the same one. I don't know. He is just cutting in front of me now. I'm also pretty close, like 11 nautical miles from the airport. 9 nautical smile, in fact. Flap 3. Speed checked. Flaps 3. Flaps full. Speed checked. Flaps full. Landing checklist. Ecam memo. L landing no blue. Radar altimeter alive. Landing checklist completed.
Okay, he is now beneath me, that plane. He is like somewhere in front of me here. There he is. He is landing beneath me, before me. And he is on the left hand runway, for sure. He is right here, I saw him here. There he is. So he is landing on that runway, I am landing on right. Doing guyless. We are landing on this one. Wind is still crazy, guys. Wind is still crazy. He's fast, yeah. I have actually I activated my descent phase faster than him that's why he's fast but look at my position while landing look at this my nose is facing this side my runway is this side so there is a deviation there he is almost there he is there 1000 check continue 1000 checked He's almost on that landing pattern. You can see him down there. He was down there, just uh, there he is, there he is. Is that a plane taking off? Right in front of me. Or did he land? There is a plane taking off. Did he land? There is a plane right in front of me. They're not going to let autopilot go until we are like 200, 300 feet because of the wind what what is that plane doing okay never mind he crossed he crossed so fast look at this 100 above continue minimum we have taken the control but it looks really really bad guys we are landing crap continue hundred above minimum one hundred Fifty, forty, thirty, twenty, retard, retard. Is Spoiler. that plane here? Why is this Turkish Airways in front of us? Because of them we had to land right, but we controlled it pretty well. We managed the crab landing for the first time so well, guys. Although the Turkish was here to really, really get us bad, but we managed somehow, guys. That was my best crab landing so far, guys, I think. Let's go. Let's go to the parking bay. Ready. The Turkish Airlines was here to destroy my landing. It says 500 FPM, but I don't believe I was so hard. <laughs> Maybe that plane distracted me a bit. Ladies but and this is the I feel of I was good. Please remain seated with your seatbelts fastened until the captain has turned off the seatbelt sign and the aircraft is parked safely. 
It didn't felt so hard. Uh, corrected right before landing. Pretty good. Everything looks good. It did not look too fast, man. PTS movement. Yeah, the Turkish guy. After landing checklist. Radar and predictive wind shear system. Off. After landing checklist completed. It did not look too fast. I thought my FPS was smooth, but it says my FPS was like 500. Did not feel so hard. Or maybe he was in front of me, so I didn't feel it like that. But it looks smooth. Never mind. It's me to blame. Strobes are off. Landing lights are off. Taxi lights are low. Wing lights are off. So let's taxi to the standby. Charlie, I believe. Is this Charlie? I believe this is Charlie. Yeah, this is Charlie. Why landing looks so hard? It did not. Why did it still go like this? No idea why did it still go like this. It never looks so hard. Anyways, we will take Charlie all the way. And then we will take, we will lose November 6, November 5, November 4, 3, 2. We will take November 1, then November Whiskey, then Park at Terminal T something. So let's see. It didn't look so bad, man. Why did it still came down like that? So we are not taking November 5, we are taking November 1. Another Turkish down there. Turkish always spoil the party. This is November 2, which we will exclude there. Look, there is a retro livery there. We will see it in the second race. And this is November 1. So we will take this. November 1. Uh, there is clearly certain no entry here for you guys. Go all the way through here till we will go all the way from number one till we reach that whole hard pattern out here for Tango November Whiskey. So, this is the right that we will take and on to November Whiskey on the left hand side. Never mind. I thought that was a classic, but that is, I think, Singapore Airlines. Yeah, I believe that is Singapore Airlines. Yeah, Singapore.
This is known by whiskey. And we will take any tangle strand down here. Let's take this bravo, in fact. Only Turkish Airlines, eh? most of them. Because we are in Turkey. Get down engine too. Shut down engine one. Shut down engine one. To always listen to. Parking checklist. Take off runway. Parking checklist. Cancel checklist. Cancel checklist. Cancel checklist. Confirmed. Runway three right. Confirmed. T cast. Cancel checklist. Cancel checklist. Roger. Parking checklist. Parking brake or chocks. Set. Engines. Off. Wing lights. Off. Fuel pumps. Off. Parking checklist completed. Cabin crew disarm slides and cross check. Cabin crew, disarm slides and cross check. Whoa, that plane went through me. What is that? The plane is going through the terminals. Oh my God. What was that? That plane went through the runway and through the parking ways and everything. Damn it. Securing the aircraft checklist. Oxygen. Off. Emergency exit lights. Off. EFBs. Off. Batteries. 
off. Securing the aircraft checklist completed. Yeah, that, that they landed from that side and went it through us. I don't know why is that so. The brand new livery uh, airport scenery and still it's acting like this. Really? Why did it happen? Why did the plane came through this side? Is there a runway on this side? There is no runway on this side. How come a plane come from this side and then go right through you? All the runways are from that side to this side facing. I hope that wasn't a Turkish. <laughs> I thought the same. I hope that wasn't a Turkish water Helen. Seems like it was. At least you know, got it right. Look at this. How many Turkish airlines here? This is Fly Dubai. That means uh, Dubai Airlines, Turkish, Turkish. This is Moroccan, I believe. In the AL Algeria, okay. Then all the Turkish ones here you can see EasyJet. This is the retro ones Azerbaijan, Baltic, Turkish. This one is Nobilair. Which one is this? Qatar? Okay, I was like, I haven't seen that is Emirates for sure. I know that big guy, Emirate guy. This is an A3. 80 if I'm not wrong. A380 or A350? <laughs> Turkish boys there. Finally, I'm going to go. Yeah, Paji, crosswind. I'm going to go. Happy, I'm going to go. I'm not 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 going to go. Was it A380 or A350? Which one is this? This is Royal Jordan. This is KLM for sure. Turkish. It's a big airport, guys. Look at this. There is a runway like on this side. The one he's lining up right now. But he's not lining up. There are many runways. One is here, two are in the middle, and then one is across. Two are in the middle here. Yeah. The one he is taking off is 3 far right, 3 far left, and then there is another two of them down here. So, big airport. I am not sure, but I am not sure, but I am visible hota hai kyunki maine wo fsl tl rakha hai na wo fir sabke traffic se aata hai explain ke bhi ye bhi that's why it's it's visible ye a380 hai the side ka tha look these are dreamliners the big ones here this one is a dreamliner this one is a dreamliner this one is a dreamliner and then some small planes here all in all a good airport guys Good airport. What's up, Mohammed Timani? Yeah, I remember you, brother. And we are off, guys. You came just in time while we were getting off. Anyways, guys, so wishing you all the best till tomorrow. I'll see you guys. Have a good one. Bye bye from Turkish Airlines. <laughs> we all have a light Turkish next time and do a watermelon landing. You know what I mean? Maybe fly from this Istanbul airport to somewhere. What do you say, guys? Should we fly from Istanbul to somewhere? Let's see how how it will go. Okay. I think all the passengers are off as well. Passengers, are you off? Yeah, zero passengers. Anyway, so. So, aircraft is off. So, that's a flight. Hey, no worries. Yo, 
आएगी या ट्रांसफॉर्मिंग नहीं इसमें भी आ रही है पर वो इस साल के एंड तक ड्रॉप हो जाएगी मे बी देखते हैं आई होप ट्रक एज एम पी स्ट्रीम्स ट्रक एज एम पी आर नॉट लिंग दट गेम फॉर वन डे फ्लाई सेवन फोर सेवन ट्राई टू लैंड ऑन साबा एयरपोर्ट ना दैट्स इम्पॉसिबल मैन यू कैंट एवर लैंड एन ए थ्री ट्वेंटी देर आई ट्राई टू हैव लैंडेड ए थ्री ट्वेंटी वन बट लैंडिंग ए सेवन फोर सेवन ए इज नियरली इम्पॉसिबल यू कैन डू इट आफ्टर ए लॉट ऑफ ट्राइज विद सम हेड विंड फ्रॉम द अपोजिट साइड यू कैन लैंड बट इट्स रियली टफ We'll try sometimes. I know you're having some chill time. <laughs> like this guy is standing here. <laughs> he's like, he's like, hey brother, let's play dandia. We don't know what is dandia. It's a famous kind of a dance where you use sticks to play with your partner. He's like that one. Hey, let's play dandia. Come on, <laughs> look at him. Come on, guy. I'm standing here. So she's a lady or a boy? Looks like a male, nah. Huh? She she is a female actually. Wait, is is he a male or a female? Let me check that before I leave. He will be where am I? Where am I? Right down here. Yeah, right down here. Oh, my camera speed is too too high. I have something better. Yo, <laughs> what better do you have in mind? Is it? Is he a boy or a girl? Let us check that before we leave. No, he's a male. He's a male for sure. He's a male. No, she. It's a female. It's a female. Okay, let's play dandy, madam. Let's go. You and me. Let's play some dandy. Who's the child? Fly A three ten and try to land at local airport and try to take off from local. <laughs> So you got some challenges for me. We'll try that next time. For sure, we'll try some challenging here, but next time, when we get some free time, we will do this for sure. So till then, guys, have a good one. Hasta la vista.